Hi, I'm Jen. Thank you for joining me this morning. How is everyone at home? I hope you're doing well. Okay, just let me ask you this very quick question. Do you like to clean toilet floors? Yes? No. Oh no, not me. <laughs> I don't enjoy it. But you know what? It requires a lot of upper body strength, don't you think? Well, you're, what we have today is upper body workout. So we're going to do it together. I hope you are properly attired. Okay, you can put on your shoes, but we'll be focusing a lot more on the upper body and we're going to start real soon with a warm up. Are you ready? Okay, we are going to start with shoulder rolls. Okay, so you can start putting your hands like this and just do your shoulder rolls. Okay, making sure you're standing straight, you're bracing your core, and you're breathing in and out. Okay, and reverse. Breathe in and out. That's right. Are you doing this with me? Yes, you. Yes, no sitting down. Stand up. Yes, thank you. Thank you. Stand up. Yes, I can see you, you know. <laughs> now we're going to do arm circles. That's right. Breathe in and out, still bracing your core. Very nice. Let's reverse. Very good. Are you feeling okay? Yeah, we're just warming up. We haven't started the workout proper yet. And then we're going to move on to our chest opener. That's right, open and close. Okay, so now if you find yourself very unstable doing this like that, you can put one leg up front, okay, and do this um, chest opener. Don't forget to breathe in and out. That's right. Whew. Okay, next one. We're going to go up and down. Okay. And also diagonal. That's right. Working up the op upper body. That's right. Only 30 more seconds to go. We can change, switch to up and down as well. That's right. Whew. I can feel I'm getting warm up. Are you feeling it too? Diagonal. About 10 more seconds to go. And then we're going to start. Okay, now, if you don't have any weights, it's okay. You can do this without weights. Um, today, I have these two water bottles with me. I'll be using that, okay? Remember, you can do without weight, but if you want a little bit more challenge, use this. All right, so the first one is single arm bicep curl into press. So what happens is you're going to do a bicep curl and then you're going to push up, okay? Palm up, squeeze, go up, okay? So we're going to do it alternately, okay? Follow me, all right? That's right. Squeeze your weight, okay? So you can feel the tension on your biceps. You can do this without weight. It's all right. Keeping your elbows close to your side. Now we're going to take a break. Okay, so it's 45 seconds work, 20 seconds break. Next one is called the lateral front raise. Okay, so we are going to come up doing this and this. All right. This and this. We haven't started yet. In one second. That's right. Right now. Lift it up. Bring it forward, bring it to the side, forward. Now what I don't want you to do is shrugging your shoulders because sometimes we, we forget, okay? We become so stressed with doing the workout, we lift up our shoulders. Now the shoulders has to be away from your ears, okay? Relax, breathe in and out and just do your lateral raises, front and to the side, okay? Very nice. Now also, do not lift it up too high. Okay, just um, shoulder height will do. So bring it to the front and to the side. Front. Okay, take a break. Now, at any time, if you need to take a break, please do so, okay? Look after yourself. Next one, we're going to do a tricep kickback, okay? So I'll show you from the side, okay? So you are going to hinge from your hip. All right, bringing your hands to the back. 
keeping your elbows to your side and you're going to do the kickbacks, okay? Squeezing the bottle so you can feel the tension on your triceps. Which part is the triceps? Let me just show you, it's this part. Now, if you need a support, you can hold on to a chair. Hinge still from the hip, okay? Keeping your elbow to your side and do that alternate arm, okay? You can switch over. Don't forget to breathe in and out. So you can use a chair for support. Today, I'm not going to use that chair. Okay, I'm just going to hinge from my hip and do my tricep kick back. Squeeze the bottle so that you can feel the tension on your tricep. Now, taking a break again, 20 seconds, all right? Next one is called the upright row. While we are resting, I'm going to show you the next one. So you're going to hold the bottle like this and you're going to lift it up, making sure your elbows are higher than your weight, okay? So you're going to bring it up. Again, do not shrug your shoulders, bring it away from your ears. So let's start. Breathe in and out. Very nice. Let me see you. You know I can see you, right? Yeah, how come you're sitting down? Oh, you need... Okay, so that's okay. You know what? That's a great idea. You can also do it sitting down since we are just focusing on the upper body. Great idea. Breathe in and out. That's right. Breathe in, engaging your core. Now taking a break and we're going to repeat the entire circuit one more time. Do you remember what the first workout is? You do? Great job, great memory. Five more seconds to go before we start and it is... You are right! The bicep curl to the press, right? That's right, let's do it. Up. Switch. Up. That's right. Keeping in mind, how's your shoulder? Is it very close to your ear? Remember to, you know, make sure that it's away from your ear. Are you engaging your core? Are you holding your breath? Yeah, don't hold your breath. Breathe in and out. Very nice. Be mindful of your form, okay? We're building up our upper body strength. Great job. Keep on going. Again, if you need to take a break, you can. But please come back, okay? Now, break time. What's the second one? That's right. Lateral raise, front raise. Again, you can do it with, uh, with weights or without weights. You want heavier weights? Get those foot in the can. Make sure they are same weight, okay? Yeah, moving on to the next. All right. Lateral raise, front. That's right. Making sure it's shoulder height. Not higher than shoulder, all right? Whew. Breathe in and out. Feel which part of the muscle are you working on. Whew. Great morning to work out. Thank you for joining me. I'm glad you're here with me and I'm not doing this by myself. Don't forget to breathe. Don't hold your breath. Break time. Next one is tricep kickback. Remember, hinge from the hips, elbows to the side, and then you're gonna do those kickback, okay? In eight seconds. Rest, have a sip of water before we continue. Let's go. Hinge from the hips, okay? Hands to the side. Squeeze the weight so you can feel that tension on your tricep. Very nice. Whew. Breathe in and out. Okay, if I were to turn to the side, it will look like this. Brace your core, okay? Engage your core. Do not let your gut hang out. Breathe in and out. Okay, I'm gonna come back to the front. Don't forget to smile. And it's break time. Last one, what is it? Upright row, that's right. The one that your elbow is higher than the weight. Yeah? So we've got 10 more seconds to go. 
Rest for a while, relax your shoulders, shake it a bit. Hope you're feeling okay. Let's go. Now, if you feel feeling unstable, you can always put a foot out while doing this workout. Okay, for more stability. So you feel grounded. That's right, otherwise you can stand that way. Uncomfortable in this one, in this position. Ooh, 10 more seconds to go. Almost there. Then we're gonna be moving on to the second circuit after the break, okay? It's break time, so we're gonna take a break right now. Come back, okay? Don't go away. See you soon. Welcome back. Well, sorry about that, but welcome. I was so excited. Welcome back, okay, to the second circuit. Okay, oops. Hey, I've changed my weight. I thought I needed something a little bit heavier. So if you feel that your weight is a little bit too light, you can always increase the weight, okay? Again, it's not necessary, but you can do it, okay? So we're gonna start. Okay, this is a very cute water bottle. This is actually a water bottle, okay? So cute, right? Yeah, yeah. You know, so yeah, you can do a little bit more heavier for a little bit more challenge. You really want to build up that upper body strength, okay? So yeah, uh, let me show you what is the first workout, okay? It's alternate bicep curls. So you're going to put your hands up, okay? So if it's a little bit heavier, you cannot really straighten your hand, okay? So you need to put a little bit of a bend, all right? And you are going to lift one at a time, keeping it, keeping your elbows to your side, all right? Breathe in and out. Breathe in and out, that's right. How cute is this water bottle? Doesn't it really look like a dumbbell? Yeah, yeah, you can get one of this. Keep on going. Breathe in and out. Let me see. You know I can see you, right? Yes. That's right, not too low. Don't, don't bring it too low down, okay? Just here will do. It's tiny movement. Squeeze the weight so you can feel the tension in your bicep. Breathe in and out. Now take a break. The next one is alternate front raise. Okay, so just now we did the side and the front. Now we're gonna alternate it. Okay, one hand at a time. Yeah? Okay, hang on. We've got five more, five more seconds to go before we start. Stand straight. Let's go. Front raise, okay? So alternate. Bring one up and then the other goes up after the other. Yeah, I hope that makes sense. Okay, I didn't know what I was saying just now, but yeah. Again, not too high up, just shoulder level. That's right. Breathe in and out. Again, I know after a while, you know, we get so stressed. We tend to lift up our shoulders. No, you don't want to do that, okay? Relax, bring it away from your ears. Lift up one at a time. Breathe in and out. We're working those shoulders. That's right. 
Very nice. Next one, okay, so now it's a break time, 20 seconds. The next one is a tricep crossover, okay? So again, hinging from the hip, you're bringing your hands to the back, okay? Palm facing outward, okay? And you are going to cross. Now, if lifting the weights is too difficult for you, put it down, okay? Do it without weights, okay? So you are doing it without weights, pushing it away from your body, cross over. Okay, let me stand on the side so that you can look at the profile. Bring it away, cross over. That's right. Doing this, yeah. Squeezing it so that you can really feel the tension on your tricep. Okay? So I'm coming back to the front. Breathe in and out. Again, if you notice that you're slowly coming up right, okay? You want to be mindful to lean forward again. Hinge from the hip, pushing it away from your back. That's right, rest time. Next one is a forward row, okay? That one, we can use the weight. Again, hinging from the hip, okay? You are going to row. Five more seconds to go, not yet. Don't start first, not yet. I'll tell you when. Right now, okay? Yeah, hinge from your hip, Roll. Oh, it looks like I'm perspiring a lot on the floor. Okay, now if doing two together is difficult, do it one at a time. One at a time. Okay, now if that is still um, too difficult, hold the chair, hinge from the hip. Lift. Use the chair as a support, okay? Change hands. Okay, and now it's break time. Okay, so I hope that works for you. We're going to start with... That's right, alternate bicep curls. Are you ready? In five more seconds. Do you like my weights? Ready? Let's go. Is your grandchildren with you? <laughs> this workout is great for masters and seniors. And the grandchildren can join along too, without the weights. Are you working out with me? Yes, keep going. Again, at any time if you need to take a break, please do so. But please come back again. Breathe in and out, engage your core. Eight more seconds to go. Whew. Squeeze your bicep. Take a break and we are moving on to alternate front race. Okay? Ten more seconds to go. I'm going to just put this here for a while. You can shake it. Okay, if you feel your wrist is getting a little bit tired, you can do without weight. If you want to continue with the weight, it's also okay. Yes, now we're going to do the alternate front race. Okay, not too high. Shoulder level, one at a time. Now, I don't want you to do it too fast, okay, because we are building strength. Do it in a controlled manner, okay? It's even difficult if you do it slower. Try it. Can you feel that? That's right. So, breathe in and out. Still engaging your core, okay? Again, this workout is focusing on the upper body. So we're not doing very much with the legs. But if you want additional challenge, you can do a little bit of a squat, okay? But I'm not doing it today. Rest time, okay? Next one, I'm not going to be using the weight, okay? I'm doing it without the weight. What is it? What was it? Yes, tricep crossover, okay? Five more seconds to go. Shake it all. Relax, okay? Relax, relax. Don't so stress, okay? Yeah. Hinge from the hip. Working on the tricep. Where's your tricep? Here, that's right. Bring it away from your body. Okay? Yes, yeah, squeeze. You can even squeeze. Squeeze it. Feel that tricep working. Breathe in and out. Away from your body. Again, I'm showing you my profile. Okay? Crossover. 
Now you're realizing, if you're slowly coming and straightening yourself up, be very mindful, bring yourself back, and do that crossover. That's right. Very nice. Stay with me. Almost rest time. And yes, whew, rest time. What's next? What's next? Ah, I think forward row. Yeah, I almost forgot. Okay, five more seconds to go. What was the forward row? Again, still hinging from your hip, bringing your weight down. You can do one at a time, okay? Or you can, if you can manage it, do both hands at the same time. Whew. Be mindful not to shrug your shoulders. It has to be away from your ears. Okay, engage your core. Don't let your gut hang out, okay? Don't let your stomach hang out, all right? Tighten the core, the abs. Ten more seconds to go. And it's break time. Okay, we're moving to the third circuit already. We're almost towards the end, but not the end yet. Almost the end, I said. Yeah. So this one, okay, looks like I'm sweating a lot. <laughs> okay, next one is called the outward curls. Okay, so you're gonna bring your hands to the side. Bring it to the side. That's right. I look very strong, right? It's like I'm carrying very, very heavy weight. What weight are you carrying? Bottles? Canned food? Again, control. Don't do it so fast. Slowly control. Squeeze. Feel your bicep, okay? Breathe in and out. Shoulders away from your ears. Three more seconds to go. A quick rest. Next one. Let me just show you the next one, okay? It's called the three-way race. So we're gonna, okay, I'm gonna stand a little bit to the front, okay? We're gonna lift up to the side first, and then diagonal, and then to the front, okay? So that's what we're gonna do. Are you ready? Let's go. Side, diagonal, Side, diagonal, to the front. If you cannot manage this with, with the weight, do without the weight, okay? Side, diagonal, to the front. Side, diagonal, to the front. Yeah, this is a little bit of a challenge because you're compounding it, working. Ooh, I could feel my shoulders. Okay, next one is a tricep extension. We're going to do one at a time, okay? What is a tricep extension? You're going to lift up, all right? Making sure your elbow is high up and you're going to just bring it up and down, okay? Now, is, if this is too challenging, Okay, hold it with both hands. All right, I'm gonna hold it in the other end. Okay, bring it. This is a little bit easier. Okay, so I'm gonna move back a little. I'm gonna turn to the side. Making sure your elbows are pointing up, not open up, okay? It has to be pointing up. You're bringing it up and down. This is a little bit of a challenge. If you do not want to use the weight, that is okay. Are you getting used to the movement first? Breathe in and out. You can put one leg front and back for more stability. Rest. We're going to go to the last one, which is called okay, the shoulder press. Okay, it looks like this. You're going to lift up one at a time. Okay, that's how it looks like. Five more seconds before we start. Are you okay? Good to hear. 
Let's go. One at a time. Shoulder press. All the way up. Okay. Alternately, we can bring it face front if you can handle that challenge. Don't forget to breathe in and out. Engage your core. Don't forget to put a smile on your face. Everybody okay? I can see and you're doing really good. That's right, up and down, one at a time. That's a break, okay, and we're gonna repeat the entire circuit, okay? Circuit number three. What was the first one? What was that? Yes, outward curls in six seconds, all right? How's your shoulders? How's your arms? Still there? Good, you're doing a great job. Outward curls to the side. Are you perspiring? <laughs> do you enjoy the workout? I hope you do. Okay, keep moving. Breathe in and out, do not hold your breath. That's right, breathe in and out. Shoulders away from your ears. Breathe in and out, 15 more seconds to go. Again, if you feel your wrist is hurting, put the weight down, okay, and do it without the weights. Try to relax while you're doing this workout. Next one is a three-way race, okay? So I'm going to just come a little bit to the front. Yeah, remember, the side, diagonally, and to the front. Whew. Shake it, shake your shoulders. Let's go. Up, diagonal, front. Slow and steady. Okay. Now, if the weight is too challenging for you, put it down. Just lift it up. Breathe in and out. Like it works, okay? or take a lighter weight, okay? Chances are if you're feeling strain on your wrist, okay, the weight is a little bit too heavy, so use a lighter weight, okay? And breathe in and out, all right? Now we're going for a break, and we're moving on to the tricep extension, okay? Now, this is a toughie. It's a challenge to do one like that, okay? So you can take one, all right? Use both hands, making sure your elbows are pointing towards the ceiling. Breathe in and out, stand as tall as you can, shoulders away from your ears. Breathe in and out. Remember, you're working on your triceps. Slow and steady. Very nice, my hands are already a little shaky. Is yours too? Whew. Almost there. Bring it down. We're gonna do the last one, which is the shoulder press. And then we'll be moving on to cool down. Yes, it's still at the end. I know you're happy. We did a great job. Okay, so one up, bring it down. Breathe in and out. Are you still with me? Thank you for staying with me. Let's grow strong together. Breathe in and out, one at a time. And we're done. Okay, so we're gonna quickly move on to cool down. Roll your shoulders. And to the front. Shoulder stretch. 
to tricep. Other side. All right. Take a deep breath. Thank you for joining me today. See you again. Rest well and be safe. Bye.